Welcome to World in Two Minutes. These are your headlines. Officials in Munich have lifted alerts of a possible attack and reopened two railway stations. Bavaria's interior minister says Daesh was planning suicide bombings. And Munich's police chief says up to seven people were to take part in the attack. Parts of Europe have been on high alert since the Paris attacks killed 130 people in November. President Paul Kagame says he will run for a third term in office. In December, voters endorsed an amendment to the constitution that raised the two-term limit. Under the new rules, Kagame could remain in power until 2034. The United States has criticized the president's decision, saying it undermines democracy. Investigators are trying to figure out what caused a fire at a 63-story luxury hotel in Dubai. No serious injuries were reported. The hotel stands across from the world's tallest building, the Burj Khalifa, which was the site of a New Year's fireworks display. The celebrations went ahead as planned, even though the fire was still burning. High levels of air pollution have led authorities in New Delhi to restrict the use of private cars. The drivers of vehicles with even and odd numbered plates will be limited to alternate days on the road. The effectiveness of the restrictions will be tested in a two-week trial. The decision was made after New Delhi's pollution levels were shown to be ten times higher than what the World Health Organization considers safe. Thanks for watching TRTWorld.com, Istanbul.